Hey guys, it's CJ. Um, it's that time of the month again. We have the January Never Enough Tactical Basic Supply Drop. Um, came home from work the other day and this was sitting on my bed along with the Hex Mag box, so I was pretty happy about that. But I went to move it and this one is the lightest box I have gotten. I have already looked. I cheat. But that way it gives me a chance to kind of look at what I'm getting at so I can get my words together so I don't stumble over myself so much when I'm talking. And it gave me a chance to reorganize it because I thought some of it wasn't in here. Um, first thing we got is a Cash 2.0 RFID blocking security wallet. I need a new wallet, so I really want this. <laughs> um, holds up 20 cards, stack of bills, RFID blocking material, MSRP of $19.99. And I'm going to swap this out my wallet anyway, so... <clears throat> Definitely got a good amount of space in here for just about everything. Not bad, so we got a nice wallet. Got the more robust fixed blade knife right here. Not bad, it's got decent retention on it belt clip or pant clip however you want to do it yeah that's a pretty sharp knife I wasn't even really trying on that I didn't think it would cut it so for a $20 knife that's a really good knife in my opinion right there at least for short term um, next down the list, Condor Fleece Multi-Wrap. MSRP on this one is $11.95. This would have been a lot more useful for me a few weeks ago when it was cold. <laughs> but again, it's not a bad thing to keep on hand and have around. Ain't gonna argue with it, that's for sure. Alright. Most expensive item we got is Combat Application Tourniquet MSRP $29.99. Um, official tourniquet of the U.S. Army. I have no experience in how these things actually work. I do need to look that up and get some research done on that. So I'm already working on building a small field medic kit. I might as well figure out how to use all the shit. Uh, a couple of stickers, hollow point gear, 40 caliber tire valve caps. I'm actually going to go put these on my truck before I leave to go over to my friend's house here in a little bit as soon as I get this uploaded. <laughs> these are made from actual 40 caliber casings. And to me it's just, I've been wanting casing valve stem covers for a while so at least these are real and not just the cheapo depots you get at Walmart the MSRP on that is 11 bucks we got a hollow point gear sticker for two bucks and we got a southern gunner sticker which was free in this box so I'm definitely going to have to check them out on Facebook and see exactly what they're about. I don't recall seeing them. I may have, but I'm not sure. But total value on this box is said to be $94.85. So that's not too bad. Initially, when I opened it up to look for it, I thought that I was missing something because the valve stem covers ended up getting down all the way underneath some of the packaging. So I'm kind of glad I took a bit to look for that. But please, you know, comment, like, subscribe, and feel free to go check out the Facebook page I'm starting up to go along with my channel. And as always, thank y'all for watching.